Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. Can subscribe down below, give us a like, and do share. Thank you. Today, we'll be talking about goose and geese. If you only think of a goose as the guest of honor on your Christmas dinner table, think again. And many people have discovered a goose can make a great pet, and this larger relative of the dog is intelligent outgoing and easy to care for, and it typically enjoys human companionship. It is also protective of its territory, and they are loud. If you're looking for a non-canine watchdog, a goose might be your choice. Geese adapt well to captivity, and they were likely among some of the first wild animals to be domesticated by humans and reared in a farm. Or backyard. And we also have evidence that ancient Egyptians kept domestic geese 3,000 years ago. They were an important source of food and fat throughout Europe during the Middle Ages. And these days, commercial goose farming has been far outshadowed by chickens and turkey farming. And geese are seen primarily as barnyard livestock or pets. They are great pets. Geese, they are more just than barnyard waterfowl wandering around the farm or semi-urban backyards where allowed. If you raise them from a very young age, they will form a strong bond with you and they will follow you around like a puppy. The females will supply you with eggs and you can use it and you would those of other poultry. They have become popular with eaters and organic farms as well as fertilizer providers. They have excellent eyesight and they will honk loudly to alert you to visitors, intruders and strangers. Some herding dog trainers will even use them in lieu of sheep and cattle to help train their dogs. They are fairly easy to care for technically, however they are large birds. They are harder to handle, they eat more, and they produce more droppings than chickens and dogs. They like in the farm, and if you get them as goosling, you'll need to be prepared to take care of them for like over 15 years. They are loved. Thank you.